to fit in it? Oh, oh is, that is, my, is that my shirt? Sure. No, this is no, that's Whoa, Julie, she was really flexing this shirt earlier was, too. She was, was flaunting. Yeah, I said, you I said, know something? I said, you nice know shirt. Crazy? Come on the podcast, yeah. take a seat. Yeah. Take a seat. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Tell me how you really feel, Julie. <laughs> the energy. The energy. Oh my god. No. Do an act of service that like leads up into, you know, you showing that you're more serious about this relationship and that you do want to further it. I definitely think that it's yeah, a good it act to do. Yeah, but if it's like girlfriend, yeah, I was like, weird. I was like, I don't think it's like that That's serious. Yeah, I bet. I was like, okay, but yeah, no, I would take somebody out. Oh my god, <laughs> he did. He definitely did. He definitely did. What just happened? I want a re. I want a recording of that. I want to play that back. Uh, yeah. Honestly, well, Kanye well, fans well, give me like the all righteousness, kid. like like vibe. Tyler, like, no, but like, like you just don't even guy. really understand. Like his well, art, thing, his, art, his artistry is deeper than wait, you guys on, say on, it. On, here's the thing. Wait, who are we talking about? Yeah, I know, but yeah. people be yeah. meat riding his like. But here's oh, the thing. No, you Drake fans always love to write it. No, he's just a good artist. I know he dropped one single, and then you guys are like, no, no. My soul just like a sneaker You know just what I mean You know just what I mean I love her as my feature I ain't look, don't need to see her You know just what I mean You know just what I mean What's up everyone? Welcome back to the podcast where you get to tune in and get a glimpse of the guys My name's Luciano Oh Yeti And your boy Miller and we got a guest today. We yeah. got Brandon and Chelsea. Yeah. 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 Thank you guys for coming on. We really appreciate it. They Thank have joined us for Wine Talk having Wednesdays. Us. Every day of the week. You already Every know. Day of the week, Wine Talk Wednesday. You We're already getting know. to it. Um, Merry Valentine's. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Merry Valentine's Day. True. Merry Valentine's. <laughs> to all you lovers out there, all you people that want to go on some nice dates, bring your girl out, get her some flowers. If you're a girl, right. get your man some flowers. Come on now. Yeah. Men deserve flowers too. They That's true. Their flowers. Yeah. Get right. yourself some flowers too. Yeah. 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 Get yourself right on a, on a solo dolo Valentine's Day. Yeah. Lucky knew like we were starting a podcast yeah. and he had to come down. He, he heard He's about it. He felt the love. Guest. He felt he's like, he's like, oh, it's my time on. to shine, you know, take you the spotlight. You just got a little fresh haircut. Come on, mom, yeah, man. Dude. It's all love. It's all oh, love. Shit. He's like a gazelle. Yeah. <laughs> so cute. Um, but yeah, we'll start out with some wine reviews. Uh, you guys know the deal. Um, what are we doing? This is like 40, uh, 40 to 50 seconds. Oh, it's getting mm-hmm. quick now. Um, yeah, and then we're going to do a second sip thought. Uh, afterwards for a minute and just really describe the wine for you guys for our fast review competition type of thing we you know have to name name the wine the name of the wine alcohol percentage where it's from um, description of it and a rating so yeah. there are five things that you have to do and if you miss one or if the timer goes out you gotta take a shot so let's get started Get into it. I go first. I go first. I go first. <laughs> okay. Okay. I was going. Jared's starting out. Okay. You want to go first? You feeling it, Luch? If you want it, I'll give it to you. No, no. You I feel like time. I've been first recently for okay, some reason. Yeah. yeah. I don't remember. I think Jared was first last time, actually. Was he? Oh, yeah. yeah. He was. It's okay. I'll go first. That's fine. That's fine. That's yeah. fine. Let, way, him, let him get it out of the system. Yeah. Go stream. Call me. It's dropping today. Mmm, drop that. Call me. Call me. Yeah, that one. Yeah, yeah you can have a little snippet. You already know. Yeah, I'll put in the. It'll be the end of the. Yeah. yeah. It's uh in the in his link tree down in the description below. His link tree is connected down there, so check it out. You can see his socials. Fuck, dude, I'm forgetting which way to twist this. Oh, he has lost all sense of direction and brain you, cells are working at one percent. No, I half brain cell working yeah. hard. Yeah, oh, it's no. black. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Big and bl- All right, let's go. All right. Okay, okay. <laughs> All right. All right. Ready? Three, two, one. Get to it. Okay, so I have Pothic Dark. Do it you? is um, from California. Oh, where is it? It's 13.9. <laughs> <laughs> He's starting to feel the pressure. I just got to like open this thing now. This is like mm. the hardest part. Oh my god, dude. I feel like it's not even gonna open. No, you got it. Black cork looks cool. I'm yeah, gonna be completely honest. Ooh. Wow. I feel like I only have like that was hot. five seconds left. Alright. Ooh, it smells really rich. Mm. 
It smells like blueberries. Taste, ooh, it tastes very... Tastes like yeah. failure. Yeah. No, it tastes like fucking... It tastes like you're too slow. <laughs> no, it tastes really good, actually. Yeah, you want to give your second sip thoughts? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Really describe that wine to us. Really get into it. I thought it was going to be very, uh, really harsh, but it's very smooth. It goes on very easily, and it's a bit fruity. Like, I can taste, I don't know if there's blueberries in it or something, but it tastes really fruity. Like, just like you, bro. Perfect. Thanks. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt you. <laughs> All right. Awesome. Uh, <laughs> my bad for the interruption. Oh, wow. Keep going. Um, and, just a quick uh, stray. <laughs> I feel like this is a light to medium, but a bit on the lighter side, which is crazy because it's apothic dark. Mm. Light so bodied? Yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm interested. Like, I mean, it probably would go well with, with a steak, but there's also something in it that I'm tasting afterwards. Mm. I don't know if it's a tannin or a, a, what's it called? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, what's the word that starts with S? Um... <sighs> Sulfite. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Sulfite. It's something that's like I'm tasting in mm-hmm. um, like the side of my tongue. But it tastes really good, honestly. Yeah. Okay, I heard. What was the rating a, uh, again? What would you rate it? Oh, that's what I, I yeah. had to do that. Yeah. I would have had it. No, you wouldn't. Were, you, you meddling kids. No, you were What's so the rating? Off. Which is, do you want one of those? Um, and do you, do you recommend it? Who do you recommend it to? What kind of, what kind of people? Um, If you like... If you like the uh, richer wines, like the richer, a little more bittery wines, you might like this if you want to transition into the sweeter li- wines because it's not too sweet. It's not too bittery either. So I feel like this is the perfect medium. Mm. Yeah, I All like right. that. All right. All right. You ready so to go to Luch? I wanna hold it for you. Yeah. yeah. I appreciate You're it. You're welcome. Yeah. Today. That, yeah, this is all I'm here for in the podcast for. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm Alan, going guys. verbal at the, the function this is, after. This is Alan, guys, by the I'm way. I'm not, bro. You're going to get smacked. Watch yourself. <laughs> this is, and it's not going to be with his hand. Our human mic stand that also all speaks right. words. Come on now. Okay. But three, two, one. <laughs> no, that's foul. Yeah, at least call me like a, a duppy or white boy or something <laughs> better than Alan. Let's not just act like you haven't been on like 20 different podcasts. <laughs> like, let's just say that. Like you are a reoccurring guest. <laughs> okay, so this is good fucking wine. Um, this has been on here by Brandon, um, I think, but I, I haven't mm-hmm. really yes, sir. explored it myself. It's a delicious red blend. Um, so it's best of everything. See how it tastes. Um little bittery, a little fruity, a um, little finish, short finish. Going to rate this at 8.4. Oh, you are hey. just just not there. Did so you say alcohol close. percentage? No, I did not. <laughs> okay, that's what I was going to do. I'm gone. But uh, my second set thoughts here. Mm. So what's the alcohol percentage as well? 14.5 alcohol percentage. Woo! Wow. Liddy. <laughs> wow. Um, it's a... Um, not not bad. It's a it's pretty smooth. Um, definitely stays on the tongue a little bit, so it's a mid body, um, and and it doesn't stay like where it's super bittery and stuff like that, which is great. Um, I think this is all around for the people that like a little bit of bittery, but also a little bit of flavor with it, and it's got a little bit of a a kick, you'll definitely feel a buzz going on after a glass. Yeah. This is 14.5. 14.5. So I think uh, this is a great red blend if you like bittery uh, wines, but also uh, like sweet and flavorful wines. Nice, Some good nice. good fucking wine. It's great. That's what it sounds like. Fucking Damn wine. well. Damn straight. Yeah. And I would, I would rate that probably 8.9. 8.9 yeah. yeah i remember true. the last the time we, we had stock bring it on we all that we all loved it yeah. we yeah. all like it was definitely that wine so probably that was, close to really nine good. but i don't know it failed me this time yeah 
you it, know, it, it, it kind of misses like one note flavor. There's something. Uh-huh. There's just like missing. one little thing you feel like you're missing yeah. To, yeah. from perfection. That, if they add that ingredient, they need to make a new product called Great Fucking Great wine. Fucking Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah exactly. Even better fucking yeah. wine. Yeah, um, yeah Josh, could you um, <laughs> just hold it up for me? Yes. I know, I don't mean to inconvenience you. Yeah, do we? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, it's really foul about you. We need to bring on better guests, bro. Like, what are you doing? Oh, that's actually really good. Oh, my bad. My bad. I didn't like the um the red label. Didn't see there. <laughs> but that one, is, that's really good. Helping yeah. out. Dude, the Apothic Red was probably my favorite. Actually, I, didn't, I didn't like it. Yeah, I wasn't I a fan was of Apothic Red either. Like the Red Blender it was, is the... Um, or the uh, fiery one. The f- I think mm. it was yeah, the fiery one. Yeah, super nice. The fiery yeah, one. Jared doesn't know how to use that. Just, the fiery just, um, one. I don't know. It stayed on my tongue too long. Yeah, yeah. Why is um, my name in your mouth? <laughs> you know, you know. if you would just <laughs> listen, I don't know. It was all right. Don't worry about it. Let's see you in the right, let's see if you, what happens with the court. Go ahead. Yeah, all right. Damn, I thought. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead. I thought you were going to say we'll see I something know, else. I would never, I would never. So. Couldn't be me. <laughs> yeah, I was like, He's damn. got the fruitiest yeah. mind out like, of all of them. I was like, guys. damn, Jerry, that's crazy. He's you zesty think today. That. He's okay. zesty <laughs> today. You guys He's ready? Like zesty sauce yeah, from chick Three, <laughs> two, one, go. All right. So today we have 14 hands. It is, ooh, wow, this cork is really ooh. not happening. Uh-oh. It's, got a, it's a little oh. dry. Are you twisting oh, it the wrong no. way? Brandon moment. No. What? <laughs> All right. if I'm twisting the cork the wrong way. Who do you think I am? Ooh. So Who do you think I am? 13.5% alcohol. This is a Cabernet Sauvignon from Columbia Valley, a.k.a. Patterson, Washington. Um, Wait, what's the alcohol? I said 13.5. Don't worry about it. Right. Um, right. So, ooh, a little bit bitterier. You can smell the dryness. Oh, but it's actually light body. Uh, can you taste the failure, though? Dang. Can you taste the failure? I can taste you rotting in it Whoa. with me. Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> oh, what is going on? Foul. <laughs> but, um, <laughs> no. Whoa, uh, second sip thoughts. Bro. Second sip thoughts. Second sip thoughts. Oh, um, God. What I'll say. This Valentine's Day is getting way Blue too cheese. lovely. Yeah, I picked the wrong spot on the couch. I'm between the two zestiest <laughs> motherfuckers here. <laughs> okay, second sip thoughts. This is actually, I would call this a light bodied wine. It actually comes off your tongue quite well. It might be right in the middle of a mid bodied, but it's very light. You can even see it from like the stain. It's actually really good. It is more on the bittery side. You can taste like the the dark hints of like blackberries, and I believe there were other hints of um, okay espresso and hints of spice. So black currant. Okay, so that's a really nice darker wine. I would have that with some red meats. I would have that mostly with um, more full, darker, or maybe like a lot of greens, earthier foods. So, so maybe some like stew even, but um, yeah, I'd recommend this to anybody that likes a really typical Cabernet that's just a little bit light bodied and that goes down pretty smoothly. Hi, Julie. Mm. That was actually perfect. perfect timing. Dude, I'll be honest, that's like an 8.5. You think so? Uh, yeah. That's welcome. Cool. I think it was honestly Did I just. The, no, uh, not at all. What the? I don't even raise. <laughs> no, I took them out a while ago. Thanks. I feel like you didn't have them in for that long. No, your jacket? Like so nice. Oh, that's the one you got. Oh, nice. Do we both fit in it? Oh, oh is, that my, is that my shirt? Sure. No, this is no, mine. That's... Whoa, Julie, she was really flexing this shirt earlier, was, too. Was. She was flaunting. Yeah, I said, I said, know I said you nice shirt. Crazy? Come on the podcast. Yeah. Take a seat. Yeah. Take a seat. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Tell me how you really feel, <laughs> Julie. The energy. Like, the energy. Oh, my God. No, but we put your ass on the For real, this be more than mine than hers. Nice. Yeah, you fucked up bringing her on. Oh, God. Yeah, back. Ooh, oh, man. After this shit. FBI, open up. Oh my god, it's actually, no, no, no. it's funny, it's almost as if you guys are like sisters, holy no, shit. No, no, no. Oh my god. We're both wearing my shirt. <laughs> what? No, That's crazy. Okay, no, no, no. The sister okay. thing is so okay, true. No. Yeah, yeah. No, but let me tell you something. Yeah, yeah. let me hear about this so, clothing situation. So lately, uh huh. Chelsea. Closer. Mm-hmm. Lately, you go through my clothes. No, 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 I don't. No, I she makes don't. it sound like it's not. I don't fit in her clothes. Yes, you do. I don't. No, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Mm-hmm. Okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. Mm-hmm. No, but my voice is very loud. No, but you you don't know. These are really quiet. They're really it's good at... 
uh, yeah, they, oh, they're it quiets my voice. No, no, no. I'm saying like hopefully it, it quiets it <laughs> everything uh, okay, that's okay. around it. It okay. picks. Yeah, I mean, so okay. yeah. So I'm gonna talk around the room. Okay. No, no. I just mean like wait, wait girl. We're like literally in the middle of the podcast. This is not the time. No, I want to yeah. talk about the shirts. Yeah, what no, like it's a sister thing. Like I feel like people can relate. Yeah, so yeah. So put like, it in. So yeah, like, so like younger sisters, no, that's right? Crazy. Mm-hmm. She's like, I'm getting exposed now. That's really yeah. what the problem is. No, um, so whenever we go out, and I mm-hmm. occasionally, and I'm mm-hmm. not exaggerating, occasionally, I'll wear one of her shirts, one of her pieces, right? Uh huh. And every time someone compliments, she's like. Oh yeah, that that's mine though. <laughs> Did you tell them that it's, it's my shirt? No, all right, that's OD. I don't so, say it like that. And then mm-hmm. whenever she wears mine, mind you, without asking, and yeah. very often, uh-huh. right? Like I just pull up to the party and I'm like, oh, okay, <laughs> that's fine. And then she's like, and then someone compliment, and I don't say anything. Because yeah, you, you let her have her moment. Her, thank you. Yeah. Pause. I let like, you have your moment, and then I say. <laughs> I don't scream it. She does. She's anyway. like giving it to you for like 0.5 yeah, seconds. Yeah. But so I felt like I had to do it back. Of course, just right now. it's only right. That's yeah. the responsibility. And also because lately she's been taking on. Like I went yeah. skiing today. I'm looking for my leggings early in the morning. Oh, so, oh my god, early in the morning. Dude, you know. <laughs> early in the morning. <laughs> and I can't yeah, find it anywhere. And I put it in the same spot. Mm-hmm. And she's not in the in the house at the Mm-mm-mm. time, and it's like six in the morning, so I can't call her. Yeah. And I um, I look at her room, Sin. on top of her bed. There it is in the spotlight. Demon. Demon. <laughs> and, Wait, and so then she who's took the other one with her? Oh yeah. my god. Who do you think? Chelsea. What the fuck? No, I'm older. That was so really? disrespectful. Damn. <laughs> He's saying you years. act like a child. I totally think it's the same. That's what I was like. All right, all right. That's OD. Like, you don't need to make that face. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you're bad child. You said you don't need to make that yeah. face. Wait, why did you think I was older, Jared? <laughs> he, said, he said, you're 20. <laughs> what? You said, you, you said you're 30? <laughs> right, I'm not 30, okay? You're very close. If you're... Speaking gibberish. Go on, let's take it um, <laughs> all right, so we're taking our. <laughs> <laughs> bro, these shots are, are hefty. Yeah, <laughs> man's poor yeah, everybody. Shots? Come on, man. Now, Luke was trying to get the boy Liddy. No, last I didn't even put it. No, I'm playing. Yeah. It's getting oh, it's getting better though. No, I think it is. It's getting better. Where's the chasers? I thought it was. How long are you gonna wait? There's no chasers. You want to do chasers? No. The wine is the chaser. The, way, the wine is the chaser. I respect it. Yeah. That's demon. Oh, Drink God. responsibly, people. Drink responsibly. We are professional drinkers. And whoever bought that rum is a horrible <laughs> person. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Disgusting. Very Shout horrible. Out. <laughs> Shout out Kirkland. Shout out Kirkland. Fuck Kirkland. Yeah, That's the worst Hello. fucking spice Hello. rum ever. Hello. Shout out. Hello. Shout out whoever oh, bought it. It's to be sorry. another Drake, no Kanye, <laughs> debate. It was you? Oh, it was Lucha. Yeah, <laughs> no. I, I, bought, I don't I handle that Costco slander. It was my, bad. my suggestion. It's after your shipwreck, too? I'm, I'm, it was I'm my suggestion. King. It was yeah, my suggestion are. for getting it. Because it looked yeah, great. It was $14. King. Look at the bottle. Like It looked awesome. No. It did look good. Fuck Kirkland. That's kind of it's kind of like bad more decisions, more bad decisions. Good on the outside, <laughs> you know damn well you like yeah, BJ. Well. Hey, you like giving them out. Those are great points. Hey, and this hey, is why you're rum king. Kanye was Drake now. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Honestly, well, Kanye well, fans well, give me like the all righteousness like like vibe. Like, Tyler, no, but like, like you just don't even really understand like his 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 artistry is deeper than you guys say it. Here's the thing. Wait, who are we talking about? Genius. Yeah, I know, but like people yeah. be meat riding his shit. Like, but here's oh, the no, you Drake he fans always not. love to write his. No, thing. he's just a good bro, artist. Bro, brought, I know he, he dropped one heard. single and then you guys are like, no, 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 no. He no. just okay. No. He's the he's thing with that Kanye guy. though. He's creative. He's fashion forward. Like, oh sorry. I'm gonna go sick. No, go sick. No, go sick, Julie. No, this is what I needed. Has always been. 
been like a fashion god, like the pinnacle uh-huh. of fashion. That's Kanye. He's okay. killed it in fashion. Yeah, Yeezy of course. Killed it. Yeah. Like with the trends, killed it. Mm-hmm. Music killed it. He made his with own the- trends though. That's the thing. Yeah. Yeah. Drake like, just hops mm-hmm. on trends. That yeah, part. Like, like, I respect that. Mainstream. All his albums, like, what is that video? The Runaway. I just watched. Oh, it. my Twisted Dark Fantasy. The Twisted Dark Fantasy. That whole video, literally, like. Drake could never. Drake could never. <laughs> and Drake is talented too. Yeah, yeah. Can't, he, he can't really really though. He's not this. No, no, no. I no, I completely understand. He's yeah. Artiste. He is. He is. He's extremely versatile. And like, uh, he is. I think. I think they're both. I think they're both like. Uh, no, no, no. Sorry <laughs> for interrupting. Uh, I think they're both different in their own ways, and they're mm-hmm. like. One is great at something, you know, getting popularity, popularity, and all this stuff, and like getting the listeners and all this stuff, right? He makes good music, but one is also just a genius. Like you, mm-hmm. he's he's so artistic, mm-hmm. so like creative with everything that he does. You know, producing music, fashion, whatever. You know. But. I think the yeah. comparison you just can't really compare. Well, both, yeah, you know what I'm what saying. Yeah, if I'm talking about they're on like different sides. Yeah, because like in yeah. terms of like fashion stuff, of course, yeah, like yeah, yeah. obviously Kanye got it. Drake's only had a couple collabs and such, and but like, like producing as well. Yeah, is producing like nothing like, close produce, to him. And he's pro- Kanye's produced so much they're stuff good, for other people. They're both good. Yeah, in their ways. yeah, yeah. yeah. Was Kanye's had some shit albums so, though. So we were just having conversation. <laughs> I'm just gonna be honest. Like what? Jesus King? Yeah, bro. That's probably his worst album. Literally. Oh, Jesus is King. He's literally anything after life of pablo like that shit was ass i'm gonna be completely honest still stuff here and there but like okay yeah like crickets bro like this last album he dropped wasn't even his like main album that he's supposed to drop donda's probably the best thing he's dropped in the past like 10 years just be honest wait you wait did you say life of pablo was a flop no 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 i said anything after what about yay i didn't like yay it wasn't that good of an album i think it was i all mine. Yikes. <laughs> all mine. Okay, all mine was good. Um, um, I didn't. I thought about killing you. Follow God. Yeah. That was actually pretty good. That was on Jesus. King. Oh yeah, that's my bad. That was the only I song think, I liked I think on that what shit. Michael's saying is that like it just never hit the way that his pa- his earlier albums. Yes, uh, that's yeah, the know? same way as Drake though. Yeah. Not, but, but also, but Drake but is Drake in like Drake still has put out pretty good bangers. Like yeah. Kanye has still put out like shit. You know what I mean? Like there's a difference. Bless you. I don't know. It's yeah. hard. I mean, and it's hard. all opinionated, obviously, Listen, but yeah. still. Like, yeah. Because you think Kanye can hop on trends like Drake can? Ooh. No, because his mind is too... Is exactly. That's why no, I'm saying it's different. His mind is too mm. oriented to doing his own thing. Drake is just trying to hop on trends yes. so that he stays relevant. They have different... That they have different... Uh, it gives the like, people what they want. Kanye is so different that he does yeah. whatever the fuck he wants, and exactly. people love it. True, but like, whoop did he scoop? But like, 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 whoop did he scoop? What? Like, come on, man! Come because on, he man. gave Drake that no, song. No, that's what I'm pissed. Because he was going to. Because that's when yeah. Kanye fans talking about some. But that's catchy. What? <laughs> whoop did he scoop? Whoop did he scoop? He dressed up as a Roblox character and did like. I don't okay, know, like what are we talking about? Right? I know it's like, but like, what are we like talking a, about? Start bringing up race. He did, he, did, he did that, but like, a did he? Did he hit that? Bro. But he who did he? He did that. Yeah. Yeah. But, he did but here's the thing, though. We're talking about a race. Jealousy here's the thing, is a disease. Get well yeah. soon. With that one song, <laughs> who made the? <laughs> with that one song, who made the song? I don't know. Kanye Peter made the beat. Whoa, fire, bro! And then he gave it to Drake. And instead of giving it to Drake, he just recorded over it and I know. dropped it. Before it sounds Drake like the it. worst idea I've ever heard because he dropped whoop. Did, actually, but it, I get it. You it's know, marketing. He did it. Yes. Yeah. That's exactly why. But whoop did he scoop his grade? Mouth. You take it out. My mouth clo- take it out. <laughs> <laughs> no, I said we. I said we could take it out. No, I yeah, think not well, like well, we. Well, no. we won't take it out. <laughs> no, I meant like we could take. He's it out like, let me take it out for you. <laughs> like all of us have like. Let me get that for you. I said you can take it out. <laughs> you can take it out now. <laughs> yeah, some sass. <laughs> no, you can take it out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like right now. Yeah, you should stop all the smacking. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> all right, I'm happy that we all agree that Kanye's better than Drake, I but can we move right. on to the okay. non-scientific questions, please? So, glad we came so I won't move on from that if you say some dumb ass shit like that one more time. <laughs> please, please. <laughs> all right, so it's a happy, uh, you know, Valentine's. Great, great podcast so oh. far. You know, no, no fighting, no hate. No. It's all love. 
you know, it's, it's just Valentine's. good combos. So it's yeah. all, it's all love around here. Valentine's is all a capitalistic <laughs> scheme to get people to spend money and consume. That was one of my questions, actually. I actually did have up. Um, Do you think that Valentine's Day is it's for true. the actual love? Do you think Every it's for... Every day should be Valentine's I mean, yeah. Day. Okay. No, okay. same as Mother's wait, Day. Wait, wait. Yeah, I want to hear this. Cousins, I don't know. My cousins what do you think? in <laughs> Belgium, they were like, all the holidays you guys have are so fucking commercialized yes like, it's we for hate it over here mm. we we actually don't celebrate it in spite of really you guys like yeah because interesting it's, it's bullshit wow. it's true it really is, it is i mean it's so nice like i will still celebrate it because it's nice you know to have a day where you celebrate there's nothing of wrong course with it, right mm -hmm. but i understand what they're saying yeah. mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. there also are a lot of people who like just feel special or make the other person yeah. feel special just for that day. And then yeah. the rest right, of the Right, and then they said, fuck that. Bullshit. That's exactly... Oh, that's yeah. awful, though. Yeah. Like, yeah. Why would you only do that, right. you know, mm -hmm. like, just for one day out of the year? That's what I mean, though. Like, every day should be Valentine's Day with your partner. Every day yeah. should, mm -hmm. you know, be special. I feel like, yeah. you know, if you have a good relationship with them, obviously you would treat them right every week. Right. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You would give a little here and there. Obviously, you, you don't have to always know. give, like, flowers mm -hmm. and stuff, like, stuff that are expensive all the time. You know, you do little your gestures. own little gestures mm -hmm. yeah. of yeah. love, whatever is in between. Mm -hmm. But that one day, obviously, you know, you could show out a little bit yeah. more, you know, with stuff like yeah. that. Because obviously it's, it's very, you know, um, yeah. mainstream, very popular mm -hmm. type of day. And that's fine, you know. But I think going the people, mile, the people that don't go that like extra mile with small gestures throughout the year and stuff like that. And they wait for that one day you know, on Valentine's. Bro. That's just yeah, that's yeah. sickening. Yeah, I agree. I think there's certain things, though. I will say, like, certain relationships are... <laughs> but, I don't know. Certain relationships do move on a different um, wave where... Um, I guess this is my one thing where it's like, I completely understand that point of view because I don't like that. What are we... You just laugh over here. Yeah, no, no. No, no, I'm so sorry. I'm just laughing at that. I lie. I lie. Yeah. I lie. That tip. <laughs> Dude, no, she's I fucking. No. <laughs> I was like, thinking of TikTok, yeah. so funny. and I was like, you you got no me. idea. That's funny. I'm the blueprint. <sighs> yeah, I feel that. Um, yeah, no, I was gonna say. No, I was gonna say. I guess some relationships are definitely more mellow in general, so that could be their shared day where that's fine. Yeah. Um, but I also, I, I can definitely agree with the fact that. It's not, it shouldn't be that big of a holiday, like just to go out on a date. And I think that certain relationships may focus on that as a point of like, yeah, that's our day. They, they yeah, I mean, yeah, they look to forward that to that. Yeah. yeah. So I can definitely agree where I don't, I think you should definitely be going out way more than that or not even going out, but like, but putting in more effort. yes, I mean yeah. like the small things, like not even always just that, but like doing the things that, you know, will make you guys mutually happy some small like you can do a picnic just you know what i mean love language. yeah i guess right. that's really what it is there's also the five love languages like have exactly. you guys heard of it Speaking you can do that throughout the year you can really do that throughout the year what are they but like physical so, like, touch physical and stuff physical touch quality time words of affirmation mm -hmm. gift giving and what's the last one <laughs> mine <laughs> <laughs> that's mine you got me <laughs> <laughs> ding ding <laughs> That's the thing that we get along so well. Yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> All right. What is? Oh, yeah. What is, Talking to Mike. What is the fifth one? one? Oh, whoa, whoa. You said physical um, talk. Cut that. You gotta talking. cut that one out. Words of affirmation. Talking. Talking. <laughs> no, I mean like text. I don't yeah. know, like that type of shit. No words of affirmation. So the five love languages <laughs> what? are words of affirmation, acts of service. Service, service, yeah. Um, Receiving gifts, quality mm. time, and physical time. So sex, yeah. Yes, the service. So so crazy. Sex. Yeah. Jared, what's yes. your love language? You can have multiple. Honestly, I feel like it's just like ingenuity. Like, That's not the love. No, like, <laughs> fuck, said, no, I said. understand. I understand. Wow. No I understand. <laughs> I understand. Like, I understand. It was a question. question. I understand. I understand. I understand. Yeah. He's always I outside understand. the box. I know. Yeah. Really you want to be informative. So bad for real, Kanye, I understand. Man. <laughs> I understand. <laughs> That's what I'm but saying. I need Kanye meat riders <laughs> all like this. They all, all right, like this. They asked me a question. I answered it. This is what I get, guys. See, this is. This is. I, five I, listen, listen, listen. None of the above. Yeah, facts, <laughs> please. Thank you. 
Well, usually when you say like none, then you get another option you like oh, explain again? yourself. So yeah. Um, but we didn't ask. I'll name them again. He wrote in no, no, his no, own but, answer. But, but continue, I'm gonna say ingenuity because I can tell. <laughs> <laughs> listen, <laughs> listen, listen. I can tell like through acts of service, through gift giving, through words of affirmation, all that shit. Like it might not be genuine. It might just be like I want them to. But your think, love language is. Shut up. <laughs> I want them to like. You can literally do all of that and just think like, I want him to think no. like they like you. Shut me. up. But like, if I could see like you're being genuine with your ex, like whatever you do, like I could see that. No, I can but tell I'm that. saying you personally. What are you giving? What am I? I'm giving myself. No, like you, but you're if you don't like it, then you don't like it. Do you? I don't think you're hearing. Yeah, us. you're not understanding it. That's Here, I'm gonna answer. Bro. I'm gonna answer next. So I will say. Um, there we go. For ten minutes, that the next ten minutes. Go ahead. Okay, Jared. Jared, salty now. Now you're salty. Okay. Over there. I'm just saying, like, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. All right, Jared. <laughs> if you want to throw stray <laughs> shots <laughs> because <laughs> Chelsea got <laughs> on your shit, Brenda has right. not talked about the podcast. Go, you go ahead. That was nonverbal at the function. No, Jared has a point though, because like. If, when you're in a relationship, like you're like, oh man, we haven't been on a date in two weeks. I ought to take her out to eat or something. And you just do it because it's required. Not yeah. because you want but to do it. I get and that. that's Jared. That's, not yeah. that's, not that's it exactly. Love languages but is that's my love what language. your genuine love ah. language is. No, there's you, that five. Is my genuine no, language. You, you, you do not you understand the question. Word affirmation, acts of service, quality time. time. Quality time. Get no, but what Jared's saying is. say quality time. Like, yes, those are love languages. But. Like those aren't something that like are like those are requirements I mean, in a relationship. Fine, like how you love. Yeah. So yeah, a hundred percent. Those are requirements, yourself. bare minimum. But I'm saying, how do you present yourself in a relationship? Or what do you? Prefer? I would say quality time as okay. myself. <laughs> I don't know quality Yay. time. Quality time. There you go. I'm so glad we came to a conclusion. <laughs> Fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> like, no, I I do I do yeah, get I'll that though yeah. I do like you know no, I that get what uh. You're saying. You know, you're not, obviously, it's something that, you know, uh, a lot of people see, you know, what to expect in a relationship, you know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Like, and you guys are, like, kind of just thinking about, like, why don't you just love me for me and what I do, you know, all this stuff, instead of, like, fuck what the world wants exactly. and all that stuff. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, I, I get that as well, but, like, we were just being, like, I guess <laughs> we were being specific on, like, what genuine kind of love language that you give out mm. type of thing and i think we worded it receive. a little wrong and it was a little you know kind right, of so pressure I, yeah I would i'm sorry say, i'm I would sorry say quality we, time we kind of pushed it too much you, you know you don't have to be sorry you give me you quality know. time don't worry i think michael should go next michael yeah. go so. right ahead <laughs> actually answer the question we've heard that a yeah. lot of times um, yeah, yeah. i prefer i think for me it's i don't know i will say it's a mixture of like I'm in between quality time and physical touch because I don't know. I do like or, no. I'll say quality time because I'm not always like. You don't have to pick one. I have two. Yeah. Okay. Bad. Well, I'll or say. Or you could even like. I have I'm gonna. List I'm gonna. All yeah. Bad. All the above. Well, yeah. I'm, a, I'm a mixture yeah. of like I would say like quality time and physical touch because like I definitely like the physical touch of things like feeling up on like you know like the girl I'm with or whatever it may be and just, then like, small little touches. Yeah. Small. Little, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. It doesn't have to be like all yeah. sexual. Just like you know touching up yeah, on you. Just, just like feeling up on. Game. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Like I'm there type like, of deal. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, right. Love you, babes. Right. That's crazy. But um, <laughs> a little slap going by. He said, "Type." Uh, on the head. That's crazy. <laughs> that's crazy. Just her little just no. that. Yeah. Um, Love you, babe. Love you, babe. Actually, I I was gonna say I quality time, hundred percent because I just enjoy like I do love to have like really good conversations, deep conversations, and then just like enjoying spending my time with other people. Um, especially because I'm not one with uh, right, yeah. technology, but at the same time, I also, I appreciate acts of service. Like if someone's like, like it's something that I've like, so what you want from them? Yeah. I like, mm. I like, yeah, more, I guess it's more what I want from them, I guess, yeah. because maybe that's not my love language then. Cause but language is a language you'd like from. Yes. But it's not a language seems like conversation. So it's like, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, but I see that I like acts of service as well. I think that's like, I don't know, like it's cooking important. for me or something. Like I like. That shit is OD, actually. Like, it's such a small thing, but it's like, when it's someone so cooks for me, it's so it's thoughtful. So thoughtful. Like, yeah. all of a sudden, you just sitting there, and it's like, all of a sudden, they're chefing up, and then, like, they bring out something. I'm like, 
excuse me like yeah. why is this guy is like show with us yeah. Yeah. yeah yeah for me yeah, for real. me literally mm. i swear i've gotten like a straight like hard on just because the meal was so good i'm like i'm like <laughs> i'm like fun. like, like honest no immediately i was just like i was like honestly i'm getting horny because she just made me this meal and that yeah. was so hot like i swear and on it my tastes fucking good dude, it, and, it, said, yeah, and it tastes good pasta? okay but what if no, it doesn't not butter, butter. <laughs> what, if, what if it doesn't I'm taste not dating good becky though. from it's fucking just, literally chapel hill like what are you talking about what if, what if it doesn't taste good though are you still like you have the same energy or like not soft. the same but she energy try, though not but the same energy i'm sorry you know i appreciate it it's a thought that's count is it still qualified as quality time or like it's like slight quality time. I'm like, I'm like, okay. mm-hmm. that's so good. But you're not gonna tell you're her. Like, oh my bad, god, though. you made me some food. Wait, would you lie though? Let me well, get the salt. You're not gonna tell her it's bad though. You have to be honest. No, I'll be honest. I'll be honest. I'll be like, I'll be honest in a nice way. Yeah, in the nicest way. I'll be like, this is like, this is a seven with a room for improvement. You know what I mean? Yeah, like I'm. You're Gordon Ramsay. Yeah, exactly. I'll be like, you know, like you're not an idiot sandwich, but where's the lamb sauce? Where's the lamb sauce? Like beef Wellington. The beef Wellington. It's undercooked. What do you want? It's fucking raw. <laughs> it's raw. It's raw. <laughs> it's come here, come raw. here. I want you to see this. I want you to see this. <laughs> fucking Do you see raw. This? <laughs> Do you see this? <laughs> if I had her come the over and said, "The only thing raw come is here. me Look right here. Look at this. <laughs> That's a, come, t- over here. come over here. Come here. Touch the center of that. It's cold. It's frozen. What do you want me? To- <laughs> You're serving um. fucking frozen food. <laughs> what, Chef Mike back there? The microwave doing shit. <laughs> you doing good, Gordon Ramsay impression. I absolutely good. loved all of his shows. I'm gonna be honest. Yeah. <laughs> I said. Where's the idiot sandwich? Beef Wellington and idiot sandwich. That's all he needed to know. <laughs> The Wellington okay. is one dish that I would love to try. What is your yeah, language? let's go. <laughs> Facts. Are you My, on your phone? No, I was. <laughs> I, I, so Luch got a notification on his phone, and I saw the time, and my, my watch phone. was off, so I decided to adjust the quest. Watch is that? This is a Seiko watch. This is a watch I recommended to Luch, nice. and I actually got one myself now. It's nice. Um, very nice. <clears throat> thank you. Thank heavy. you. So Can I actually so take clean. a peek? Yeah. Um, but my love language say, is definitely acts of service or um, phys- like with a side of physical touch. Because mm-hmm. 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 if like if you see me we'll working mm-hmm. like on a computer stuff. and I'm sitting there and I look stressed and you come up and you just like rub my hair or something mm. like yeah. that's an act of service yeah. with like a side of physical touch. Mm-hmm. Like that is yeah, for real. like I will fall in love with you. Mm, like that gets me going. Head scratch. Yeah, that's a love language. Head scratches. Yeah, I'm just like a dog. Head scratches, back scratches. I love that. That does it. Yeah, I feel that. <laughs> or when they start unzipping the pants and stuff. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that too. Nah, head scratches are mad nice though. Like the, the hand in the back of the hair. Weird. A hand in the back of the hair and the head. That's like the most like weird shit ever. When feeling stressed and they start unzipping the pants and shit. <laughs> I, the shit I heard like, oh, it. Oh, this shit is back. Dude, Luke's going, what? What did I say? All right, let's be Bro, like it might be a little bit too tight. Exactly. It might be too tight on my waist, right. you know? So okay. lose weight. Exactly. I would, hey. I would, no, I would need to lose weight, but <laughs> oh at the same time, God. it's like, wow, they really noticed that, you know? Yeah. That they know it's me a, so it's, well. a, it's a little too yeah. tight for me. Hey, yeah. Hey, yeah, exactly. I'm going to tap into that. You know? I'm going to be honest. There's no, not a better service. stress reliever that's also an act of service than unzipping your pants and just hugging right. you up. I don't know. Right. I'm just saying. Right. But... 100%. Uh, let's go off of uh, what she has to say from the last question about the love language. Do, don't tap because then. Oh, okay, that was a good no. question. Mine is. So what's your love language, Julie? What's your love language? Ingenuity. <laughs> me too. Hey, Luch, you didn't go. No. Me too. Oh, I didn't. Uh, Luch didn't go. I just no, got me too. She'll go. She can go before me. I. You get cut. Cut. Nope. Cut. Nope. Cut. That's in. Cut That's in. <laughs> That's in there. <laughs> no. So, uh, so what's my lang- love language, Luch? What's my language. With my language, uh, English. Personally, English. What is it? <laughs> um, it's the good, the good acts of service. Um, I think it's a little bit of everything. If she don't got that gog gog, then what? Oh my god. <laughs> um. Okay. 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 I, love languages at this point, I know. Like, I know. Um, I know. Come on now. We're talking about acts of service. Isn't that a love language? Bro, I said a little bit of everything. Oh, so I like. Like, I like. I like a little right, bit of right. everything. Where I don't know. Do you have a favorite? I though? just. I just kind of. Uh, I like 
to go a little bit of the extra mile sometimes, you know, or like to make so it acts of, acts of service yeah is it yeah. acts of service but like you're, also like, like affirmations like, like, like making oh, sure that they're tired or whatever let me go so word affirmations coffee. yeah word coffee of affirmations shop, shop. acts yeah, of service word of affirmations acts of service you yeah. bring on the flowers and stuff so i could see you being acts of service type of dude honestly. yeah love letters i do write yeah. love letters. so that's so weird that's words, yeah. of words of affirmation yeah 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 i'm horrible at words of affirmation i'm i suck Mm. Like, I will. Do, I fucking I fucking love you. Suck. Yeah. I said like besides like I love you. I don't really do the whole oh. reminding you. I'm not a good texter. When I'm yeah. in person with you, like <laughs> I spend like I love quality time. Yeah. Sorry, I just like totally cut you off. No, you're good. But like I love quality time. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I can continue for the tenth no, time. You need to go. You need to go. You need to go. I think that's it, pretty much. Mm-hmm. So, because what are the other ones? Physical words of touch. affirmation, physical touch. I do like my ingenuity. physical touch. Words yeah. of confirmation. Right. Words of ingenuity. <laughs> ingenuity. Affirmation. Words of affirmation, acts of service. I do like my touch, like back scratches, massages. Yeah. yeah. You know. Yeah. Back scratches, top tier. Love it. Honestly, mm-hmm. not sometimes like. <laughs> 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 no. All right. Like I'm exaggerating. Maybe like. Sometimes, like, you know. Yeah, yeah, that's it. The fuck? No, but like, even though, like, if you're, like, sleeping together. Yeah. Like, locking pinky toes, I'm not even kidding. Yo, what are you talking about? I do love that shit. No, no, I, I love that shit. No, 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 I love that shit. What are we talking about? No, no, I do love that shit. Wait. So hot. I like that. 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 I like where you're at, but pinky toes had me, honestly. Wait, okay. Because me, personally... I can cuddle for like two seconds Same. and then I'm a, I'm a hot body. Yeah. I'm a heat radiator. <laughs> like I, like I will burn the bed. Same. Like, my body is so fucking. Like, it starts steaming up. If you're trying to wake up I in a kiddie pool, yeah, I heard if that. I'm like in there for too long. I will. No, oh yeah, I feel suffocated. <laughs> I will beat you up. Like, <laughs> she about to throw hands, over. bro. So like. You're I'll like, whoa, whoa. Be, so we're, hey, chill. <laughs> we're just sleeping I'll together. Back up. We're on opposite ends, but like. I want to touch. Yeah, it's enough. Yeah. I mean, we're not actually <laughs> in our yeah. You know what I like to do? You know what I like to do, actually? I told the guys about this, but I like to do, like, butt touching, like, while we're sleeping. <laughs> yeah. Like, back to back. Like, if you're back to back, like, like if, if your butt is touching yeah. mine, then I'm like, all right, we're, like, yeah. we're good. Like, yeah. <laughs> no, that's real as fuck. I can't even do that. I like touching I eyelashes. I can't. All right. yeah. I can do like, no, no I, I hear you though. Cause like, eyeball to eyeball. I, I be getting so hot. Like eyeball. I need your body separated from mine, but I'll put like just my hand on like, you know, your side of your body. Cause like, I'll, I'll go from like full clutched up and I'm like, all right, I need my, I'm like hot. Yeah. Your knee Grab your ankle. grabbing his nose. Let me get your wiener on the bottom of your elbow. Let me just touch a little bit. Yeah. I like it a little bit. I don't know. <laughs> no, that's crazy. While you're asleep, that's wild. While you're asleep is crazy, but like yeah. if you're not asleep, I mean, like oh, yeah, yeah, yeah look at your ear a little bit. Look. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Anyway, now that we're done, no, 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 we're done talking about you. Oh my, my God, turn. It was so, turn. It's been your turn. It's been your turn. turn. Was it really? Yeah. I didn't feel like it. Because I'm self-aware. You're so so strong for that. Thank you. Chelsea, what is your love language? Thank you. Um. Wow, Jared, that was fucking rude. Thank you, Jared. Didn't you for answer already? I did. She answered like I thought you did, but no. you already answered. Yeah, let's, Chelsea, let's go ahead. <laughs> Chelsea, go ahead. So, what's your love language, real quick? Wait, wait. No, my, Just I'll, say it, and then really we'll pass on. Yeah, really yeah. Gift giving and. You'd rather give gifts than so words of affirmation. Acts of service. I love giving gifts. I love giving gifts. Then words will, of affirmation. Like, if I'm They're happy. free. That's, that's from her, though. You know, no, because I, I suck at like reassuring with words. Mm. Like I, I really suck I see, at it. I see, I see, I see. You know what I mean? But, but gifts, like, you. Like, but gifts, I love giving gifts. I'll, I'll go to a store, I see something, and I'll just think of him. I'm like, all right, well. Okay, that's cool. You know what I mean? Right, and nice. like for I holidays or birthdays, when I go sick. Like, mm. I, I want to yeah, literally give him everything. Like, <laughs> if I have, if I'm Drake, I have all this money, I would buy a private jet. Like, I would go above and beyond. Okay. But yeah. that's just like, yeah. And then I don't know what the other one is. What is it? Words of affirmation, quality time. Quality time is the second one. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Definitely. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Quality. Thank you. What about so you, Chelsea? For your input. <laughs> anyway. 
<laughs> Mine is. <laughs> you do this. You did this on the last podcast. What? Like, just go. Mine just go. Is... Fuck it. Go yeah. ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> um, quality time and acts of service. Okay. So it's like I feel like it's really important to see something and be like, oh, I thought of this person. Mm. Or like also receiving that. Like, oh, mm-hmm. I thought about you when I saw this, so I got it. Like that means so much. Yeah. Like it's something so small, you're like, you thought about me, thank you. Yeah, yeah, I hear that. Yeah. <laughs> like even like if they want like they buy you your favorite candy. Right. Mm-hmm. It's something yeah. you know. It doesn't even yeah. have to be wow, you really Bro. thought about me during like the yeah. whole day. Yeah. You just like And also like gift giving. Yeah. Gift giving. I love receiving gifts and I love mm-hmm. giving gifts mm-hmm. because gift giving you put thought into what you're getting them as well. It's like acts of service. Oh yeah, that. Like really yeah. Similar. Me too. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The thought one, I like. I really like that. Honestly, yeah. I really liked what you said about the love letter thing. I feel like that's very rare. Mm-hmm. And nowadays we don't do that. My requirement is, even though I'm not gonna have <laughs> requirements. I ask any of like my exes that they all know. I always ask like holidays or my birthday. I want. A love letter. I would rather really? have that over a gift. Mm. It means a lot. Yeah. And yeah. actually, I will write one as well. That's the only time that mm-hmm. I'm really like pouring yeah. my heart out. But I think it's very special. It is. Like when um, I couldn't get like a, a letter to go like you know in, in the store and like get a good like mm-hmm. letter from there. Um, I would uh obviously like I would get a letter that has like a empty like template you know, yeah. and then I would write it for myself. Yeah. But like there'd be times where I couldn't get the whole template Mm -hmm. and I would make it like off of paper and just like off of that, doing something just, Mm -hmm. you know, off of paper, you fold it, blah, blah, blah. And it's like, it it seems like something like, you know, like cheap, you know, whatever, blah, blah, blah. But it's, I feel like it's just the act. Your words aren't cheap. You know what I'm saying? You're expressing how you feel. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think it's cheesy. If you think it's cheesy, I think you need to grow up. Yeah. People who think, like certain things are corny or whatever like mm-hmm. you just need to yeah you they probably to, haven't experienced them too because i you think need to mature and mm-hmm. also once you do feel mm-hmm. it one day mm-hmm. you will understand but when then again but someone you're just yeah and you're but i think it's like the flowers thing like i've like i've yeah. met girls and like i've like have like talked to girls that like don't like flowers and stuff like that and it's like i don't understand because it's like or even cards like one of the girls i talked to she like she was like I don't get the point of a card. You just throw it out. And I was like, okay, like it's the card is not the point. It's what you mm-hmm. say in the card. That's the mm-hmm. point. But like, mm-hmm. if that's what a present means to you, like, and then okay, not appreciating like, everything. You know what I mean? But like, I'm like, I'll definitely it's like, it's important with to words, appreciate so. each other's love languages. Yeah. I agree yeah. with that. Yeah. So I think it's just an interesting thing, mm-hmm. but that's cool. Yeah. Have you ever, your ten takes. have you ever had like trouble uh, agreeing with other people's love languages? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, 100%. Oh, yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 100%. 100%. Yes, for sure. I think I noticed in a lot of relationships that I like am around, the biggest issue that people struggle with is like quality time. Mm-hmm. It's like, oh, like some people are good with just like sitting and chilling with their partner, but some people would rather not. I'd be like, let's, we can hang out when we do like something important. Mm. But it, And then some people are like, well, I just want to like, lay down your room with you yeah you know yeah it's interesting i like that though i think that's a good one just because just to be completely honest i feel like you should be fine with just being in each other's being presence. each other's yeah. presence yeah exactly because you shouldn't really have to do a whole lot just to feel like or like you c- like you can be silent with them in a room and like not feel awkward kind of deal or like just be in their like space you know what mm. i mean i feel mm-hmm. like that's definitely something that you should be able to feel comfortable mm-hmm. with. Right. But you shouldn't also have to feel like you need to do something. We need to go do this or go do that to go have quality time right, or just enjoy yeah. yourself with that person. You know what I mean? I think also going through all like different type of relationships, you realize what your standards are and mm-hmm. what you need. Mm-hmm. Like yeah. what love languages. Like for example, like my last one, I wasn't getting much word affirmation. Mm-hmm. And so I told myself for my next one, I that's something I need. Yeah. Like I wasn't, I didn't realize how important it was to me. Because mm-hmm. in the beginning, I was, you know, it's always like that, the cupcake honeymoon phase. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You get yep. ev- literally everything. Yeah. And then as it dies out, then it gets it real. Just, you know, then you get comfortable and 
then it's like not there anymore mm-hmm. and you don't realize how important it is to be mm-hmm. reminded to keep that spark well, for going. me personally yeah. to be reminded yeah to keep yeah. the spark going and mm-hmm. stuff yeah but for me specifically was word affirmation mm-hmm. and like my current na- current one now i get that word affirmation yeah. nice like all the time and he's mm-hmm. very well spoken yeah he's like he's like a poet yeah that's so natural <laughs> like, yeah mm. but not gosh. even in like fucking dating shakespeare not <laughs> even in a corny way because if you meet him he's not even he's not like that yeah, yeah he's yeah. just really good with his words yeah but i i feel like me three years ago like my first boyfriend ever i would be like hell no like don't do any of that that's so fucking corny mm-hmm. you know but now it's you know as i grow older i realize mm-hmm. it's something that I need. Yeah. Yeah. Mm, that's cool. I think that's it's good. also putting your ego down. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Yeah. Being more comfortable is probably really what it is. Because I word, think yeah. I think it's something that like even something as such like Valentine's Day we've talked about. I think I've definitely been in like relationships or like been with people that like think Valentine's Day is very stupid. And it's like mm. I've definitely mm. been that person too. Where I'm like, yeah, it's like Valentine's Day is so stupid. But like that was me while I was single, while I was young. Right. And I'm like, the more you get kind older, of like a hater. yeah, exactly. I'm just being a hater, bitter yeah. for no reason. And it's not like it's not like I ever yearned for like a Valentine's Day day. I wasn't yeah. salty that I didn't have a Valentine. You know, it was not like that. But it was just more like I don't get it. Like you know, whatever. But I think as I got older, I got into a, like a serious relationship, yeah. and then like once you start to get into that, even like in a more serious manner, you're like. Okay, I actually want to set something up. Like I have to have like right. plans and reservations and make now. sure. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And then I'm like, okay, this is not stupid. Like I get this. Like, yeah. and also once you see how much <laughs> it means to the other person, yeah. like that's huge. You know what I mean? I was about to. S- is like mm-hmm. so- I was gonna say like, do you think it's more because of what they think, or what you think in that aspect of what you were saying? Like, mm-hmm. um, like doing stuff because of what you want them to react like. Or versus like how it makes you feel. Yes. Yeah. Like personally, versus how you make how it makes you feel or how it's gonna affect them. Oh yeah. Or I guess like, I'm. What's the bigger? What's like the, what weighs bigger? Um, I would say personally, I think it's how it affects them. To be honest, yeah, I'm like I personally, like I don't like it's gonna make me feel good, but like it's gonna make me feel good regardless. It's like satisfying to see. Yeah, that, you that's know, yeah. Happy about like it, the yeah. the only like, yeah, actually the satisfaction that I get out of doing the act is from yeah. their satisfaction. Mm-hmm. Like, I'm not happy until they're happy exactly. kind of deal. You know what yeah. I mean? And when yeah. I see that they really enjoy that and they really appreciate it, like, the things that I did that for them and the gestures that I went through to, like, go through that, I think that's when I'm like, all right, like, this is fire now. Like, now we're late. Yeah, I mean, it's 100% yeah, worth yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, like, that's a high in its own, honestly. Yeah, of course, yeah. Just like anything in life, honestly. Yeah, yeah you're right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Would you guys... Or have you guys taken a non, um, like, girlfriend or boyfriend to a Valentine's date or done something? To a Valentine's date? Yeah. Do you, like, like is there a requirement, like, a, like, do they need to be your your uh, significant other to take them out? On Valentine's or Day or just, I think just specifically like in for general? Valentine's yeah. Day, like, yeah. Like, val- on Valentine's Day. Uh, no. Because I, I feel hmm. like. I know people who are always like, oh, I don't know if I should expect something or I don't know if I should do something with them, you know. Mm. Like, it's always, like, kind of weird. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like I've always been in a relationship where I've been taking them out to Valentine's, so I never really experienced that. Oh, so you that. never experienced yeah. that. Yeah. Have you guys? So, I, like, I'm not, I don't really care for labels. Mm-hmm. You call it whatever you want to call it. You call it a situation ship. Fuck buddies. What well, I don't really give a shit. Mm. But if you want to go out on Valentine's Day, I'll take you out on Valentine's okay, Day. It, yeah. do, it doesn't matter to me. Because it, like, to you, it's not like that important. Like, yeah. You don't put it's not that I don't care about Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day is more of like, it's a reason to do something. Right. Like if you're like, okay, oh, we've been doing. busy yeah, yeah. for two weeks. We haven't even seen each other. Here's a good reason to do something with date. with each other. Yeah. Even if it's something small. I think it depends where you stand with that person. Yeah. Mm. And I think as long as maybe, like, you communicate right. communicate it and, like, I don't know, talk about the importance of Valentine's Day, that it's understood between the both of you. Yeah. Cause maybe, For me, like, personally, I see Valentine's Day as just, like, couples, like, relationships. Yeah. Oh, you missed my question. Uh, mm-hmm. I don't know. I was, I for was, friends? Uh, asking. Well, yeah, you want to take a girl that's not your girlfriend? Gal- Valentine's, Valentine's Day. Day. You just take anybody mm-hmm. or somebody you're talking to mm-hmm. to Valentine's Day date or just a girlfriend? 
Me personally, I'd probably I would take somebody you're talking to or a girlfriend to Valentine's Day. I think especially if it's someone you're talking to and it's like you're in the talking stage and you want to make do an active service that like leads up into you know you showing that you're more serious about this relationship and that you do want to further it i definitely think that it's yeah, a good it act to do yeah but if it's like girlfriend based on yeah yeah, yeah. Stand, right? for friends i would say no i wouldn't take my girlfriend or i yeah i wouldn't take my friend that's just a girl out oh, to no, no, valentine's I dinner that. i meant like uh, somebody you're involved with. oh like, yeah yeah no i would yeah, take no, somebody that, out like yeah that, i was like weird. i was like i don't think it's like that that's serious crazy. yeah i bet i was <laughs> like okay but yeah no i would take somebody out Oh my god. He did. He definitely did. He definitely did. What just happened? I want a re I want a recording of that. I want to play that back. Spray it in your face? Why was he laughing so hard? So funny. Dude, my boys be making each other giggles. Oh god. Oh god, they be giggling. Are you guys like flirting? Basically. No. No. Like he stuck his tongue out. He said, "If you can make that booty jiggle, you can make." <laughs> no, I Wait, said it totally what? wrong. I said, hey, no. yo, "I know." The pause, saying is, "If you can make him pause. laugh and giggle, you can make that booty jiggle." So I think Jared. Hey, you still got wine on your face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> I think we just, uh, I think we just ended off, huh? Please, yeah. yeah. All right, guys. Well, <laughs> yeah. So we're gonna wrap that, it up. That will be the end of the podcast. I hope you guys enjoy. Make yep. sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Make sure to check love. them out. What you want to see next? Love is love. Of course. Happy and, uh, Valentine's Day. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Have put a great that Valentine's. in the comment uh, if you guys want to see them back on Thank again you. or mm -hmm. just want that nothing uh, to do with yeah. them. You know, just let what? us know. And, <laughs> and, if, and if anybody has a crush on us, please comment down below. <laughs> Yeah. yeah 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 please right. you, happy valentine's you happy valentine's happy valentine's day we hope you enjoy it. see you in the next one peace. peace peace if i told you i don't want to know you